To my channel what's going on one more time this is your boyfriend rosario and uh we are here today because i gotta move all this out of my way before i tell you why i'm doing this thing i'm gonna let you know hit like hit share subscribe and stay tuned whatever i'm gonna have i got some merch coming and you're gonna see that soon but today today i got something real nice coming up and this is it we have arrived one of the plate for the electric water pump from K-Tune. There you go. All the parts are here, the belt. This is for the alternator, for the B-Series alternator. The bracket for the B-Series alternator comes with the screws, comes with the housing, and the plate. But before we gotta do that, of course I gotta move all this. And then we gotta remove all that on this episode. So, Stay tuned, let me move this out of the way, and we get going. All right guys, so this project is moving on, on real good, real fast, you know what I mean? So, I have here just arrived, I'm gonna put this to the side, just arrived from CC Clutch Performance, stage three, Clutch kit comes with everything that we need for the hatch, is right here, just arrived today, that's gonna be another video, but I just wanna show you that I arrived. Another thing that came through is this right here. It is, basically the oil filter goes like that. And there's attached on the bottom so we can put the performance line for the turbo. So that's pretty cool. That's all right too. And of course, I'm making a video on the on the progress on my body work that we're doing but today is about this and how are we gonna start doing this let's see remember guys this is the other motor that we about to do here it's seen better days since we've been sitting in our garage for a while in spider webs everywhere but this is the next motor is gonna get built and uh Hopefully get the water pump too, but to do this is very easy. I mean, I already got the belt off and everything off. So we are taking this out. So what we need for that, we're gonna need, look like a 12, I already took that bolt out. And uh, you're gonna have to take this off the bottom right here. And it's gonna be Allen keys, Allen keys. We're gonna take this out. And this is what we're gonna take out right here. And after this comes out, the whole unit comes out. whole unit come out then we can start scraping and you know check it out what's going to happen with the with the other piece i know for a fact that this right here i gotta take it off and put a plug here because we're not using that no more and i'll tell you right now why i mean we can use it we can put a plug here and then run it to the thing but we're not doing that we're going to cover right here we're going to plug the other one on the other side so it's not going to be that plug on it so let's start it, right? I don't know you guys, but I'm more excited than anybody else to see this happening. So, give me a minute. All right, guys, welcome back, welcome back. Let's get a screwdriver. So, I already loosened the bolts, moved everything around so I can have space here. So basically, I took all the bolts out. And uh, we're gonna about to see if I can do this with one hand kind of deal. I'll put it right here. Comes out of the old water pump system. Comes out. And now I have to uh, make sure all this is nice and clean. Clean all that up. And I gotta take these studs out. They don't no longer work purpose to do nothing on them. Let me do that first. Got one of these. Come on, 
place. Don't mess up your strap, your your um, thread. That you can reuse this for another build if you guys want to. You know, like me, I got a couple builds here. So this is very important for me. I don't want to mess it up. So what I want to do? I want to save it. Same thing here. And what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna get the air, air, I'm gonna air this out real quick and I'm gonna get it to mine for whatever, clean this up. You, you do not want to use silicone on this setup because this is bait, it's built so you can take it off and put it back on how many times you can. All right, so. All right, guys. So I'm leaving the video where I left the last time. I did. All right, guys. So this is what I've been so far doing. I see I barely made the holes in the front. I'm about to do it. I measure it right here. I'm gonna cut the hole right there, and I'm gonna put the other one in. Then we're gonna put the alternator on and the belt, and this motor is done. It was in. So let's get to it, right? Look how I did the hose, nice and done. And now we're gonna do this one. So I got this right here measured. So I wanna cut it. I wanna get ready with my saw and we're gonna cut that off, okay? Stay tuned. All right guys, I got the hose done. I'm just gonna put it on. Basically it's gonna go here first. And then I'm going to put it right here. I did it too long. But I'm going to play with it right now. Make sure you, when you put this on, it goes in perfectly. You don't want to Press right this over here, close that one, press that down. Like the first one on top third, there we go. And then I'm gonna do this one right here. Alright guys, well, the problem I see here is the alternator. I'm going to put the alternator first. But the hose is done. I'm going to just tie it down. And it's going to sit just like that. Um, remember, you can put a 90. It goes up like that real nice. Or you can do something like this. I'm going to do the alternator real quick and get it going. So let me take this off. I got to the top. I had to grind a little bit here. It's already pre-matched it. All right, guys, so I have to mo modify the alternator a little bit, grind it here, and then grind it here and here so it can move, close in smoothly. See, like right now, boom, boom. So I'm gonna get everything on it, let me put it on. put the back one in first
Oh, by the way, one is shorter than the other one. But if you look into it, oh, make sure. There we go. Boom. Goes in there. That goes in there. And then this one. Make sure. Put the alternate first. Grab this. Put it in. A lot of people don't put the back one in. For more like a safety issue at this point. But it was designed for something, right? Boom. In there. Boom. Now the alternator can make it all the way in. And this is why you put the belt on. Man. Like that. Stretch it a little bit more. Now, before I can even do that, now I can bring it out and adjust it with this. And we're done. Um, we got this right here. Just go in. Put it in there. Okay. Use it for this. That's nice and tight. Now Alright guys, this is done, the water pump setup is done, it was pretty cool, there's no flex in the hose, so you should have no problem with that hose water and going in and going out, it was amazing, and um, I'm about to put the intake back on just for the giggles on it, because I want to get it potty coated, and how to fix this, I'm going to put it back on this, besides that guys, let's see, let me put the intake first, okay? Let's just put this intake right now. I just want to do this for you guys so you can see how this thing is going to look. Look at that. Look at that. All in detail. How you can see guys, the hose is, look how much clearance you have here. Even with this throttle body, you have enough clearance that you can put your hand right here or you can put a wrench right here. 
you can put a wrench right here where I am and then dig over there um, this is the bleeder valve everything is right there accessible um, right here this is your throttle cable and I mean your for your TPMS and then you're gonna have your harness right here your other one right here but you still got enough clearance to work with this and here your other throttle on this one's gonna go right through here and out and let's say you're changing a starter look look how much clearance right through here you can put it in look at this put it right here you see let's say you're changing a starter guys and this is on your car you come right through here bring it in Swing it around and boom. I don't have to have the pro uh, the problem I have in the CRX today. I don't have space like that with this water pump because everything goes from that big old thing to this. You clean a lot of a lot of the headaches that you got. So that looks amazing guys. Look at that. It's amazing, amazing. Looks good. Look good. This is not that hard. You just hit it with your gun. That will come out. Throw it back in the way you want. I taped the alternator in those corners because I wanted to flip more in and out. More flexible. Everything's tied down. So this is done. Finito. Guys, thank you for watching my channel. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You know what I got here? Done. You know what I got behind me? Do you finish? And guys, Thank you, thank you for driving, and this is Elgato built. And um, all the bolts right here and shit. But this is Mr. Elgato. Right. And then that's what we took out. Right there. We will have everything. Alright, guys, thank you for subscribing. Hear you later. Bye, peace out. Hit, smash your like button, subscribe. And I'll see you guys later.